Hey guys, Ash here from C4 Retech, and today in this video, I'm going to show you how to flash Cyanogen Mod 13 Nightlies onto your Lenovo ZUK Z1. Make sure you back up your apps and data because we'll have to do a full wipe to get this done. Once you've backed it up, the first thing you do is head on over to the download section in the description and download the files from the links there. Link 1 will get you Android SDK Slim, Link 2 will get you the ZUK USB drivers, extract the Android SDK Slim RAR file and then install the ZUK USB drivers, I've done that already. And Link 3 will get you two Cyanogen mod files. So this is where Link 3 will take you to and you need to download the latest Cyanogen mod build and Cyanogen mod recovery. So once you've done that, open up the Android SDK Windows folder, platform tools, and now hold shift, right click and open command window here. Now quickly jump back to the Z1 and go into settings about phone and tap your build number seven times. This unlocks developer settings. So go into developer options and turn OEM unlocking on and advanced reboot. So now hold the power button and select reboot and select bootloader and hit OK. So now your Z1 will reboot to the bootloader once you see fast boot mode connected to the PC via the USB Type-C cable. Back to command prompt, type in fast boot space dash i space 0x2b4c space devices. And assuming your drivers have been installed correctly, you will get a reply, a random set of numbers and fast boot. To make it simpler, just hit a arrow so that the last command is selected and take devices off, replace it with oem space unlock dash go hit enter now this will unlock your bootloader erase everything and your zuk will reboot wait for it to reboot and once you're back up quickly run through setup and again go into settings uh, unlock developer options and again enable advanced reboot now for the time being let your phone be as it is now back to the PC, copy the Cyanogen Mod 13 nightly file, the big RAR file, the 330 meg RAR file, copy it onto your ZUK Z1. Now if you want GApps, Link 4 will take you to this page, open GApps. From here, make sure you select the platform as ARM, Android 6.0, uh, if it's Cyanogen Mod 13, and the variant Nano Pico, depending on what you want. I generally go with Nano because it's small enough and gets you the basic Google Apps. So get this file, transfer that to the ZUK Z1 as well. And once you've done that, copy the Cyanogen mod recovery file that we again downloaded from Link3. Go to Android SDK Windows, Platform Tools, paste it there. And on your phone, select Reboot and select Bootloader. Hit OK. And now type in Fastboot space dash i space 0x2b4c space flash space recovery space just type in cm and hit tab it will fill it hit enter so once you're done with this again hit the up arrow key to select the last command erase everything till uh, 0x2b4c type in oem space reboot dash recovery now your Z1 will reboot into Cyanogen Mod Recovery. It should look this way. If it looks different, it means you've done something wrong. Make sure you repeat the steps. Over here, select Factory Reset and System Reset brackets Keep Media and Confirm. Once that's done, go back, select Apply Update, choose from Emulated, Zero Slash, select the CM13 file that we transferred. This will take a minute. I'll be back with you guys once it's done. Now once you're back, again select apply update, choose from emulated, zero slash, and now select open G apps. Again, it's gonna take a few seconds. And once done, select reboot now. Guys, your Z1 will now reboot. Remember, it's freshly booting into a new ROM, so your boot times will be longer than your regular boot times. Don't panic, don't worry. Give it about five minutes, it should boot up. So once you're up, again, quickly run through setup and we are now on Cyanogen Mod 13 built on top of Android Marshmallow with G-Apps present. So I guess that's it for this quick tutorial on getting 
a Cyanogen Mod 13 Night Lease on your Lenovo CUKZ1. If you run into any issues or if you have any queries, leave a comment below. Give this video a thumbs up if you found it useful and make sure you stay subscribed for more videos like this. So thanks a lot for watching. Till next time, this is Ash here from C4 Retech signing off. You guys have a great day. Bye-bye now.